Now, plenty of us know curling only from the Olympics, but at the Detroit Curling Club in Ferndale, the action is heating up or cooling down, should we say, at the club's International Men's Invitational this weekend. Justin Rose takes us inside the action. For 130 years, people in Detroit have been battling for the glory, the prestige, and the hardware in one of the world's oldest winter sports. The game takes skill, stamina, stout shouting, and specialized shoes to stabilize the slipping. No, we're not talking about hockey. It's curling that's taking center stage. Some people say that it's just shuffleboard on ice. It's, it's way more than that. It's, it's chess. It's, uh, there's a little bit of ice skating because you have to have your balance out here. Now the game may seem simple if you think throwing a 40 pound rock with pinpoint accuracy while teammates scramble to smooth the way to stop it at the exact spot you had lined up 150 feet away is simple. It's not, but I had a hard time finding a player not grinning from ear to ear. This is a great game. I, I love those people from Scotland, you know, they, they uh, created great scotch and uh, <laughs> the game of golf and curling, you know. It is one of the greatest adventures that I've ever been on. I, I started about seven years ago and uh, it's by far the hardest sport I've ever played. Uh, background is baseball and soccer and this puts it to shame. The Detroit Curling Club always looking for new members, and if you want to get your winner fix in, they welcome you all the same. In Ferndale, Justin Rose, Seven Action Sports. Ice curling. <laughs> I can ice tell you, it's the ice fest. It's yeah. very fun, um, but it's not as easy as no. they make it look.